Of course, we know a lot of animals and can recognize them by their look. But do you know what noises some animals can make? I think not really. Sometimes these noises are so astonishing and unexpected that you can't even suppose these animals can produce them. Now I want you to see and to hear these strange voices. Be ready to be amused. Look at this amazingly beautiful caterpillar. But do you know that some of them can produce sounds? Just listen. Scientists have known for more than 100 years that many caterpillars can generate clicking or squeaking noises. They let out squeaks that can fend off attacking birds. Now the researchers know how these creatures can do that. You know that, unlike reptiles, birds, and mammals, insects don't breathe using their mouths. But they do that with the holes in their sides known as spiracles instead. Using high-speed video, the researchers found out that larvae pulled their heads back to compress the body cavity while they whistled. What are armadillos? In Spanish, this name means a little armored one. We know that armadillos are covered in bony plates that create their armor. They are the only living mammal to wear such a shell. The plates cover their back, legs, head, and tail to protect the animal's sensitive body from danger. But do they make any sounds? Yes, they make, and very amusing and funny ones. Here they are. Listen. I think that very few people know that rhinos make any sounds. Both adult and babies are thought to keep silence, but this is not true. They are very talkative and have a wide range of vocalization. As for the babies, they sound adorable. Like a cross between whales and when you pinch the neck of a balloon to let the air out. Just look at and hear these cute little rhinos. Male elephant seals are outstanding creatures. Their appearance is very impressive. No less impressive are the calls they make. Listen how these giants sound. They make these noises for one purpose. Males weighing upwards of 4,000 pounds take part in their bloody battles to establish themselves as alphas. When they manage to do that, the males use these vocalizations to show to other beta males that they have the full control over females. You are sure to hear the lion's or a tiger's roar. These gorgeous cats sound very striking, but what about cheetahs? They don't roar at all. They can purr, meow like an ordinary cat does. Just listen. Did you see Porky it almost makes you think no. it's cute and cuddly. But this is not all. Sometimes they sound very strange and can be mixed up with the sound birds make. And these sounds are amazing. What can you hear sitting near the window in the morning somewhere in Australia? Don't hope to hear some pleasant birds warbling or singing. You are likely to hear this loud and rough laughter. <laughs> and it belongs to a laughing kookaburra, a large bird, the biggest member of the kingfisher family. <laughs> These birds produce very distinctive laughter, which is often mistaken for the calls of many different animals, such as donkeys or monkeys. The loud calls can wake up anyone in the morning. So their early dawn and dusk cackling chorus earned it the nickname Bushman's Clock. What do we know about koalas? We know that they are other very popular Australian animals. Besides that, they are fluffy and extremely cute. But when you hear the roar the male koala producers, you won't think of these creatures as cute anymore. Scientists discovered that to make such exotic sounds, 
Male koalas blow their own horn in a big way. And the bigger a male koala is, the deeper their voices are. This funny little thing really deserves its name thanks to those terrible roars. Yes, the Tasmanian devil growls like a real devil. And their name, Devil, comes from the sounds they make. They make eerie growls while searching for food at night. And when a group of them feeds together, they screech and scream. Earlier, on hearing these calls, people got very frightened. Of course, we know what sounds a horse or cow makes, but I'm sure just few of you have ever heard an elk's voice. These amazing horn things create very unusual noises. You are likely to hear the sounds like that if you're walking through the woods in some parts of the United States or Canada. The North American elk is one of the biggest deer species alive today. Larger animals tend to have larger voice boxes and longer vocal tracks. As a result, they produce lower sounds. But not this creature. Despite its large size, male elk produce shill rutting calls known as bugles. Those who have ever heard a goat scream sometimes don't understand why these animals very often sound human when screaming. Goats scream for many reasons. Most of the time they do it because they feel boredom. But they also scream when they are hungry, thirsty, and sometimes scared. When females go into heat, they can get really loud. Larger goats can, in certain ways, be louder than smaller breeds. <laughs> what sounds do we expect from owls? The hoot, one of the most recognizable owl calls, it is known as the sound of owls. Great horned owls are especially famous for their deep hoo sounds, followed by a long hoo. Ooh. But it is not the only sound owls can produce. Just listen to these terrible screeches this barn owl is making. These birds usually make such awful calls when threatened. Prehensile-tailed porcupines, or Brazilian porcupines, are extraordinary creatures. Their look differs greatly from the look of their well-known relatives. No less distinctive is the sounds they make. These adorable cuties produce baby-like calls. They have so many different intonational shades that sometimes it seems that they can't be produced by an animal. This is the end of my list, and I would be glad if you have found these animals amusing and cute. What sounds impressed you the most? Let me know in the comments. Bye!